Now let us, uh, let us do the examination of ascites where we should do shifting dullness and fluid thrill. These two are the very important part of ascites examination. So how to do shifting dullness? So start from GIF sternum, okay? you have to do percussion, the rule is same, put a, so you put a hand flat over the GIF sternal area, elevate other fingers except middle finger and you hit the middle finger at the midpoint by flexing your wrist. So you go till the umbilicus and then rotate and come towards the right flank. So once you find the dullness, what you do, you ask the patient to tilt to the opposite side and wait for 10 seconds at least because if there is a ascetic fluid, it will go to opposite side. And then in this position, in this position, you again percuss. And you, once you find the dullness, stop there. It indicates that the dullness was here in the flank area. It shifted to the midpoint or other side. It indicates shifting. Dullness means fluid has been shifted, ascites. Okay. <clears throat> the other one is you have to ask the patient to put a hand over the midline. And <clears throat> you put your hand at the left flank. On the right side, you just flick the flank here. If there is a fluid inside, there will be a ripple effect and heat your other hand. So this is known as fluid thrill. So why you put a hand in the middle? Because to prevent the transmission along the wall of the abdomen. So if you do that, the only thing that is free is fluid and the ripple effect will be felt on the other side. So this is shifting dullness and fluid thrill for ascites. You must know the causes of ascites, very important. You know the common causes are again. This portal hypertension due to cirrhosis of liver, there may be intra-abdominal malignancies, there may be tuberculosis and there are so many other causes of ascites and always try to study the causes as exudative cause and transudative cause. From here, we will go towards the liver cirrhosis and other disease. Thank you.